second we have Adrian, Adrian Morata, music entitled You Are Precious and I'm Always With You. The third we have is Marie Costa, sang the song Straight Stay True to Yourself, Simple Things in Life and Truly Blessed. Praise the Lord for their life. And the fourth one we have Milka De Leon. Chances here with you and live for you. The next one we have Marisa Gregorio. Sang the song Fly, Thanksgiving song, Sinner Sing by Grace. Where is she? She's there. And then the next we have Reggie Santos. Song Celebrate. And last but not the least, of course, Larsen Abelan. Father Fox, Jesus is alive. Here you go, composers blessed by the Lord. Sing God a mighty uh, love offering for the lives of this people. And of course, I'd like to introduce to you the singer that went with them. We have Fayan Buduan. And next we have Rox Calvin. Welcome over here, Willy Terado. <laughs> Praise the Lord for his life. And over there at the back, we've got Christian Mendoza and, and Jesse the Potor. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And of course, do you see the stage decoration? Right? Let's welcome. Let's praise the Lord for their lives. Daryl um, Castro and uh, Mary Dell Castro. church and the men's ministry in this church were also behind all this decoration. Where are you men's and women's? Just raise your hand before God. Praise the Lord for your lives. And of course, the leaders, the ministry leader, the worship ministry leader in this church, the two people behind all these things, from the flow, from the disciplining, from the scheduling and all, all these things. These, are, these two people were so blessed with their lives. The moment they came to know the Lord, they just gave everything to God. And here they are, Alex Morota and his lovely wife, Imelda Morota. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, I have not forgotten the kids. Yes. And, you know, the, 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 the tickets that you've uh, received and the souvenir that we will have first time ever in our church, um, souvenir anniversary issue there's two people who really work so hard in this in this um, souvenir magazine and the invitation and I'd like to recognize them tonight and that's um, Monette De Leon and Ronald Ronald Macapagal over there thank you thank you for, for giving your all and of course we'd like to, to 
thank the Lord for the elders in this church. Pastor Lavlin Cinco, uh, Pastor Lucy Torres, and uh, again, Juanet de Leon, Wilma Olivares, where are you? Where are you? Clarence Gregorio, Manny Mendoza, and again, Alex, Alex Morata. Thank you so much. And we would like also to acknowledge and thank the Lord for the lives of our senior pastor here in JIA Canada, none other than Reverend Rose Lavit, right here at the front. Thank you for your um, service to the Lord. We would also like to thank our sister churches from, from Burlington, from, um, from Cambridge, they're here, and from, from Durham, from um, Hamilton that are here. We, we thank you so much for blessing us. Did I forget anyone from that one? And of course, uh, our brethren from LA, uh, a missionary. She's still single. <laughs> but she's taken. I think she's taken. <laughs> uh, and <laughs> none other than a missionary, Arlene Del Campo. Uh, and, and, and her brother is also a uh, JIA uh, brethren from New York, Edwin Del Campo. Praise the Lord. Of course, we'll not forget our pastor Saida over here. She's pastoring Helen. Thank you for being with us. And for all of you that have been here, we thank God for your lives. Thank you for taking, I think, two and a half hours of your time to be here with us celebrating the goodness of God. Have you been blessed? Yes. You've been blessed? Now, before we proceed on, I'd like to call on our senior pastor to just bless us in prayer. Bless all this uh, uh, gift that, you know, people that have surrendered their lives to God to be used. And, and uh, we just ask her to release blessing to us tonight for all these things. Is that okay? Take a few more minutes. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I've been bowled over by you guys. I've just been sitting out there and... Uh, I just salute you for your dedication, for your commitment, for your passion, for your... Uh, while I was watching all these things, I couldn't help but cry. Because there are times that we face dryness. Like something is not happening at all, and I go through that as well. Busy days can just rub us out. And we did times like this. And this has been times of refreshing. And pray that all of us have been refreshed, renewed, revived, reinvigorated, ready for all that God has yet in store for us. Because for all of you that have just said yes to God and are starting out on your journey, I have only one word to say. This is the beginning of the best years of your life. And the best is yet to come. So let's just pray and call out for God's best. The one word that God has placed in my heart towards the end of last year is that I know how little your strength is. I know God knows how little, how little power, how little strength we have in your heart. But I didn't know that recession was going to come. And even then, God has said, I have opened a door that no one can shut. And what he has shut, no one can open. And to all of us, despite the changes of times and season, God has given us an open door that no one can shut. And we can hold on to that. So let's pray and bring out and come forth this open door let every head be bowed and eyes closed at this time and let's just focus on the king of kings the lord of lords that has come into our lives and we say god for every promise for every word for every song for every story that has been brought out into the open tonight father we pray that the angels of heaven are rejoicing with us. And as your word has said, this is our year for open.